What's up internet? My name is Nobuchi and I just wanted to try something different. I I wanted to maybe record myself while inking to maybe motivate myself. Lately I've been trying to work on my portfolio and it hasn't been going well. I've been finding myself unmotivated to do really anything when it comes to drawing or even to inking. And so right now I thought maybe if I just uploaded videos or just recorded myself that I would motivate myself to ink but this was the wrong time to do it because <coughs> I am under the weather recent, uh, right now. Um, I don't know who got me sick or what, but I usually don't get sick, so I feel like a fucking hot mess right now. Um, I am currently working on a panel here for the comic Batman and Robin. The pencils are done by Patrick Gleason. I managed to obtain some of these pages. They're copies of the pages because my teacher who taught me how to ink is uh, Mick Gray. And Mick Gray works with Patrick on a lot of projects and so he really helped me uh, get started on my inking career. He was my teacher at the Academy of Art University and so I'm forever grateful for him. But yeah, right now I'm just I usually ink by brush, but when there's usually big black, blacked out place, places, as you can see, there's X's. When there's that much, I usually don't ink because that's a lot of ink. So I just I ink what I can and then I scan it. And, and usually, like inking digitally, is great because look, you can make so many mistakes and then be able to erase them. A common mistake that a lot of people don't do is they don't move the pages, they don't rotate, and so it strains your wrist and that can lead up to um, carpal tunnel and you really don't want to do that at all. I have the touch off so I can use other tools to help me get straight edges, but now that I'm looking at this, I could just use the shift key to do straight edges. Um, and there's going to be a point where I should have just I've been try I there's going to be a point where I'm going to try and do an ellipse f free handed or with a tool when I just realized that I could have just got a circle off the uh, toolbar. But yeah, I it was because of Mick that I got really into inking. Inking is really calming. It's when I usually ink when I really have no motivation to draw on my own, and inking is a great way to bring comics to life. When you see the drastic difference between pencils and then having the inker on top, you can really see the difference and how dramatic and powerful an inker can be. Uh, yeah, usually I wouldn't try and freehand a lot of things, but I've been going over what my teacher has done, other inkers, and it's just a style choice is what I'm getting at. Like usually. I get on myself about being really strict that I gotta be precise, I gotta be like, I have to do it this way. But really you don't, you just need to relax and uh, just do what you think is right. And going along digitally, <coughs> the only problem I do have is that when I do ink it, I have to be this anal, trying to get every black thing straight. and. As you can see, my inks aren't the blackest of black, but I'll just go over it later with levels. I'll mess with that. But yeah, just going over it with digitally, it's great because then I, if there's something that I want to change like that, I can do it with ease and I don't really have regret. Like, see, if I did that with the inks, I would have, oh my god, it would have been a giant mess and I would have hated myself. So there are times where I do prefer inks over digital like I like doing it by hand with a brush but um, there's times like this where I am glad that I do have a Cintiq. The brushes that I'm using uh, I downloaded from a guy named uh, Kyle Kyle Webster. I'll put a link where his brushes are they're really cheap and I bought them and they didn't work for CS5 but now they do so that's terrific that it can go to a lower model. So yeah, I'm making these types of videos to motivate myself because obviously doing this, I'll actually get something done. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, 
I'll get off my ass and do some more.